Well, confidence can really be seen as a real-life superpower, which affects all parts of our life. Everyone has different sources of confidence, so here to give us tips on how we can all be our ideal selves is confidence coach Susie Moore. Good morning, Susie. Good morning, Alex. It's nice to have you on. So tell us, why is it so hard for us to sort of just be comfortable in our own skin? Confidence is something that we can really work on and improve over time. It's good. The good news is that it's you know part of something that we can completely control. One thing that really prevents us from being able to be confident is if we live with health issues. And a really common health issue is bladder leakage, which affects 65 million Americans. Um, this condition really stops people from living a full life and keeps them kind of holding back and living on the sidelines. Yeah, that's a lot of people. So what are some of the small little changes we can it's make. a lot of people. Right. What are some of the small changes we can make to sort of improve our confidence? So Depend has a great product called FitFlex Underwear, which just moves with your body so you can kind of take your, your mind off your body worries and just really allow yourself to be present in the moment, especially this summer. Right, Alex, it's such a fun season. There's so much, so many cool things to take advantage of, like um, time with friends and family, physical activities, certainly lots of social activities. So that's a great product to use. Um, and there are other great tips that you can take advantage of in your life too from a general confidence perspective. One is uh, just making sure that you're always, you know, physically in a stance that makes you feel confident. So shoulders back, you know, chin up. Um, smiling naturally makes you feel confident because we act the way we want to feel. Um, and we can also speak to ourselves far more kindly. We can use positive mantras and statements versus the kind of critical self-talk a lot of us, um, a lot of us use every day. Great. Yeah, so those are things that we can affect. You know, you're talking about the stance and you're talking about, mm -hmm. you know, being physically fit. But how important is it to listen to our mm -hmm. bodies when our body's trying to talk to us? It's so important to listen to our bodies. I mean, when was the last time you even just kind of checked in with yourself and we're just quiet and spent you know, a couple of minutes breathing and just noticing how your body feels. Your body will always tell you what it needs. If it needs a bit more rest, if you even need to reconnect with people, often you can feel this, hmm, you know, I, I, I want to be busier in my life. I want to have a, you know, a deeper connection with my friends. When we kind of tune in and really force that mind-body connection, it's really great data for us to, to use in terms of making our daily decisions. Right. And people watching and listening may think, you know, bladder control issues. Well, that really sounds like something that will affect the older portion of the population. But what's important to note, I think, is mm -hmm. it's not just the older folks, right? It's, it really can happen to no. people that aren't so old. That's right. It's, you know, it's at all ages. So it's important to know that if you live with blood leakage issues, you're not alone. It is such a large chunk of the population um, who are in the same position. And there are things that you can do about it. There are great solutions. Right. And that's why we, you, you know, you partner with the important companies like Depends who have products that, like you say, really improve yes. people's confidence. Now, where can we go for a little more information about the statistics that you talked about and also about the, the products from Depends? Everything's available on depend.com. You can also access a free sample, and there are some great videos on there, real-life footage from real people. Excellent. Susie Moore, Confidence Coach, thank you so much for coming on and uh, entertaining us and, and enlightening us about uh, this important topic. <laughs> thank you, Alex. All right. Everybody else, stay right where you are. We'll have a lot more Morning Blend when we get back.